Hi, we're going to be watching the second and final OVA of Moriarty the Patriot. That flippin' red moon. Is there murder happening? It has been evident for some time now that this day had to come. What day? It was unavoidable. I'm sure that some of you may have already heard the news. It will take all of our expertise to achieve a decisive victory. What are you talking about? Sorry I'm late. Have you already- All for one, and one for all. What? Right! Wait. Come again? My thoughts exactly, Bond. My thoughts exactly! A tea party. A tea Yes. <laughs> okay. As I'm sure you're Who's aware. Who's throwing it? So it is with great reluctance, I must say. It is finally time that our household fulfill that particular duty as well. Okay. At first I was thinking, okay, maybe they're gonna throw a birthday party for someone. As you may recall, there was once a few amongst the noble ladies who had the temerity to sidle up to Will, under pretense of viewing our prize-winning Rose Garden. But that means you're in just as much danger as he is, aren't you? Indeed. <laughs> Ordinarily, Will and I are more than capable of handling such situations. However... However, women become quite unpredictable when they let their hair down. <laughs> what? And are emboldened even further in greater numbers. It is this group psychology that is the issue. Oh my gosh. The challenge is to direct this tea party to a successful end, free from any snooping noble eyes. Okay. A battle not easily fought. My word. Mm. Yeah, I thought I'd been invited to a tea party, and then I find out that I'm stuck in charge of these dingy quarters. What do I have to do? You'd think William would trust me a bit more at this point. I wish we got more information about him. Oh well, I guess we don't really have that much time on our hands to do that. The dramatics. I've given up hope that this day would ever arrive. This is the Moriarty Estate Tea Party we've all been pining oh for. Oh my god. Come now, girls. If we let this chance get away, we'll never get another one. <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? No, no, no. It's a competition. Who's going to get to the brothers first? Hello, ladies. We are honored by wow. our presence here today. Just one. <laughs> <laughs> I get it. I understand. Very appropriate reaction. I'm sure you're well aware, but we're quite a bashful bunch. Mm. Despite all appearances, my brother William and I are nervous simply standing before you. We do hope you will avail yourselves of this opportunity to stop by our family's rose garden. Our gardener has been hard at work, and we are pleased to say his roses have bloomed just in time to welcome you. Seeing the rose garden, knowing that it's completely burned down now, <laughs> at the end of the series, tragic. So sad. This pressure is intense. Should I step in already? I don't know if they would. I don't know if you'd be able to. I was under the impression that tea parties were a much more elegant affair. An environment in which one can create bonds. Oh boy. Share secrets. Okay. <laughs> he's no he knows what he's doing, absolutely. That's what happens when you're a master manipulator and you're so used to lying about your life. Excuse me, Fred. What sort of roses are these fluffy ones here? I mean, it is a very uh, beautiful yes. garden. They're a type of bourbon rose called Boule de Nez. Too bad, like I said, it burned down. <laughs> it's completely gone. Are you the one who grew these gorgeous things? I am. He's blushing! I'm glad you enjoy them. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Everyone in this house is hot! <laughs> That's what they're all thinking. Um, I... Oh no. <gasps> My roses. Oh no. Fred, don't kill anybody. I hope you're all right. Oh, okay. Those thorns can be nasty. Oh, God. Oh. I thought he was gonna lose it and snap. Sir, uh, I'm terribly sorry, but I stumbled on my way out to the garden uh -oh. and I shattered this lovely teapot. Only the best for William. <laughs> They're in awe. Oh my God, this is so funny. We will let it steep a bit longer. Brother likes it strong, after all. <laughs> <They're> <laughs> this is incredible. Absolutely fantastic. I love this. Simply keep that in mind, and it shan't give you any trouble. What? Wow. I never would have He's giving them a map. 
Lesson. My gratitude. Oh, William. Could I trouble you to advise me on my concern next? But of course. He's a mathematician and the younger brother of an earl. Okay. And though I regrettably don't know him half as well as I would like, I'm certain he is deeply kind. <laughs> and naturally, I saw a doctor. But he insisted that only William James Moriarty could possibly cure what him. What the fuck? This I is grown crazy. More by the hour. Where is the subtlety? <laughs> This ain't my circus, mate. <laughs> what? That's so mean. Hmm? Uh, I can't help you, <laughs> Oh, everyone's a jerk. An intruder in William's room. Look at all of this. So many difficult looking mathematics books. By the looks of things, oh, I suppose William really does spend most of his time in the study. Oh? What is this? Oh, they... Okay. I was like, <laughs> it better not be like a secret shelf that opens up. This must be William's walking stick. <gasps> Wait, They're going to find out it's a sword. Not. Oh my god. <gasps> oh my. Look at this. It's Bond. Put together like a scabbard. Please hurry. <gasps> <laughs> William. You flippin' smart cookie. My, my. <gasps> What naughty little kittens you must be <laughs> to wander into a place such as this uninvited. Now, why don't we return to the party? Someone's coming. Albert was crystal clear that if by some slim chance anyone were to stumble upon this operations room, then I am authorized to neutralize them. Oh my god. Please don't let this end in a massacre. We were doing so far. <gasps> a wine cellar? Wait, but who opened the door? A dog? That's who she was oh, hello. fine. How did the Where dog open the door? Oh no, he opened the door. If I may be honest, I was expecting Understood. a biped. Oh dear, I thought I lost you. You have my thanks, but may I ask who you are? I am one of William's most prized employees. A problem solver of the highest intellect. All right, now crisis averted. It was most enjoyable. Thank you, gentlemen. I'm so pleased to hear that you all had a good time. We'll see you again soon. <laughs> oh, I doubt that. Our temporary hires have been compensated and dismissed. So mission accomplished? Mission accomplished. Mission Thank accomplished. You, you must be tired. It was a struggle here and there. The point where I didn't think any of them would survive, but they did. I'm sad that Sherlock wasn't involved in this OVA, but, you know, he can't, he can't be involved in every part of this area. I hope you didn't do anything untoward to the ladies at the tea party. I wouldn't have had the time. I was busy fulfilling my duties. Though I do feel like I've forgotten about something. Oh no. What? What did we forget about? Oh. Poor man. How dare they? But surely they haven't all forgotten about me. No, that, that would be ridiculous. <laughs> That's so rude. <laughs> I can't believe that. That was definitely my favorite OVA out of the two. Just because of how hilarious and dramatic and just unserious it was. And just the way that Albert and William and the rest of our crew handled uh, the situations that they were put in. <laughs> it was just so funny. Especially Fred. Fred's whole thing was just hilarious. Like, I loved every part of this OVA. It was so great and, you know, it didn't end in murder, which I was <laughs> seriously thinking it was going to, uh, especially towards the end there. And I would say it was a great, like, send-off to the series. A, a good, happy note to end it on, uh, even though the end of the series was a bit bittersweet. I'm glad that we had a little bit of a moment where everyone was just, you know, not planning to murder anybody. <laughs> it was just, uh, just, you know, a light-hearted situation to be in, and I just enjoyed it so much. And yeah, that was the series. We reacted to the whole first season and the two of yays and that's it for now at least i don't know if there's going to be any more after this a movie or a continuation i have no idea but if there isn't going to be any more i think that the way the series ended and concluded its story is pretty satisfying i will say so i think that if there isn't going to be any more within the series of moriarty the patriot i think i would be pretty content with that so 
yeah, that's all I have to say about that. So thank you guys so much for recommending it and watching it along with me. I hope that many of you liked the way that I, you know, reacted and <laughs> the commentary that I made in certain parts of the story. Uh, so yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like, like, please dislike or dislike and tell me what I can do better. Please don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell to be notified every single time I make a video. And I wish each and every single one of you a wonderful day, night, and afternoon, whatever you prefer. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye!